Since I published this video on YouTube, How to Make Money with a Desktop Laser, I have received over 370,000 views and helped many people get started on their laser marking business journey. I often get asked the question, what's the next step in building my laser business? Well, the answer to that question may be in this 10 kilogram or 22 pound box right here, right now on 3D Print Farm. This is the EM Smart One 20 watt fiber laser by Three Plazers. Let's take a peek and see what's inside the box. Ah, cool, check it out. It's blue, my favorite color. Well, let's see what we have in the box here. Looks like we got a set of laser goggles. Ooh, those are nice. Nice little laser goggles here. Put those back in the case. Looks like we've got our USB cable to plug this bad boy in. We've got a collection of little vinyl nuts and two bolts here. And the USB stick. Power cable. And looks like a 24 volt power supply. And then the piece de resistance. Wow. Get this out of here. If this arm just lifts up. Oh, check that out. Is that not cool or what? Wow. This is super compact. Check this out. Just a piece of copy paper. Place it right on there so you can kind of get an idea of how big the bed is. So, yeah. Really nice size, really nice and portable. So, what it appears looks like here is it just folds down like this. I'm going to take a guess that these two thumb screws here uh, are all you need to get this thing um, lined up here. So, I'm going to turn it around here. Looks like there's two, two holds right here. So, I'm just going to put them in there. Yeah, that's it. Wow. Less than 30 seconds to set this thing up. This is, this is really stinking cool. Looks like there's a knob back here that you can adjust the, uh, you can adjust the focal distance. You got your cool power button. Looks like an emergency stop button over here. So the Three Plazers machine comes with an anodized aluminum plate that have all these cool threaded holes. You're probably asking yourself, what are all these threaded holes for? Great question. It's for these little guys. These are pieces of acrylic that have some holes drilled in them that allows you to set up items. Let's say that you're wanting to engrave this aluminum bottle and you don't want it rolling around on the table while it's lasered. You place these acrylic standoffs in there, screw them down with these little nylon bolts that they give you and place your item in there and it stays put. Now you're probably asking yourself, well where did this little cool aluminum bottle come from? I'm glad you asked because Three Plazers includes this giant box of laserable sample goodies. And not only do you get this little aluminum bottle here, but you get a couple of these. Here's a couple here. They're aluminum um, 
anodized aluminum flasks that you can engrave. You can sell these. I mean, really, there's some other cool stuff here. There's some uh, little ID bracelets. Uh, there is a there's a compass. It's a gold compass that you could uh, uh, engrave something on the top of. I mean, there's these really heavy duty. I believe these are 0.8 millimeter uh, aluminum business cards, as well as the business card holder. So you can engrave that, stick those in there, as well as these coin blanks. There's uh, two gold coin blanks and two silver coin blanks that come in these little plastic cases. These guys are fantastic for everything. Challenge coins. If you've heard of a challenge coin, let's say that your kid's coach wants to do something cool for the team. I mean, how cool would it be to take one of these coins, engrave the kiddo's jersey number on it, pass it out to them. Uh, these are really good money-making ideas and they give you about four of these to practice on. These little dog tags here, I mean if you want to custom engrave a, for your little pooch or a, or a cat or a dog, they give you a couple of those. A, a looks like a brushed aluminum cigar case. I mean, this is, oh here's some more stuff here. Here's a couple of uh, slate tiles, plus they give you these heavy anodized aluminum coasters here, looks, which looks like a foam back. This is really unheard of as far as a laser company is concerned. In addition to this laser, they give you a ton of sample items that you can engrave. What I do is, in addition to all this stuff, they, in addition to all this stuff, they give you a box of 100 of these thin, uh, they're, uh, they're thin aluminum, anodized aluminum business cards. And what I do with these is I practice on them. Because not only does it have a laserable side on one side, it has a laserable side on the other. So that gives you, what, 200 little pallets of practice material that you can practice on before you practice on, you know, I mean, you don't want to practice on something like this. I mean, you want to sell this kind of thing. So you want to practice on these, do the real stuff on this stuff. I know you guys are dying to see how this thing works, so let's head on over to the computer and let's create a business card. Okay guys, let's bounce over into EasyCAD and as you can see, I have my business card already created to save time. I'm not going to go into any specifics in this video because it would take a long time and if you guys are interested on how to create your own business card once you get a fiber laser, I would be glad to do that in a future video. So what are these objects over here in the object list? Well this first one which is the type is a curve basically is an outline that is around this image and this text. The size of this curve or rectangle is 54 by 86 which so happens to be the size of my business card. And what this does is this gives me an indicator when I click this button here which says red and what it'll do is it will fire a red rectangle on the build plate and what this allows me to do is take my metal business cards and line them up perfectly. So everything lines up, the text lines up, the image lines up just like it's supposed to be. This build, this build map file, this, <laughs> this bitmap file uh, is inverted on purpose because we are lasering onto a black surface. So anytime you laser an image on a black surface, it needs to be inverted so everything looks correct. This last one here, it's a type of object called a hatch. Again, I'm not going to get into this, but basically a hatch is the infill on the text down here and some of these different controls, we're not, again, we're not going to get into them, but this is the type of hatch. This basically is the way the laser moves and fills in, because it moves really, really super fast, it, the way it fills in an object. 
All right, so let's go over to the laser. So as you can see, the item is starting to be marked. So when burning a high definition image, it does take a few minutes, even with the fiber laser, to get that picture perfect image. Now as far as text is concerned, you will see and hear just how quickly the fiber laser works with text. So what do you think? How cool was that? I mean, in that short of a period of time, you've created a custom business card that you can hand out to your friends and or even sell. And you're probably asking yourself, well, you know, Garrett, there's a lot of different settings and a lot of things to worry about with these fiber lasers and even my diode lasers or my CO2 lasers, there's so many different settings. I'm gonna let you in on a little secret and it is called the Laser Master Academy. Let's go check it out. Okay guys, just a quick mention of Laser Masters Academy. Uh, I joined this uh, site about a couple of months ago. It has uh, helped me so much. Uh, lots of invaluable information. Alex and his team does a fantastic job. Whether you have a, uh, a fiber laser, a CO2 laser, uh, if you're just getting started, there's a little bit for everybody. I mean, he has a Discord channel where you can go out and ask questions. You can ask questions to him as well. He runs a successful laser business, so he has all the business insight. He has all the technical knowledge, and he's more than welcome to share all that information uh, with you. And for eight bucks a month, you, you just can't beat it. Uh, and if I highly suggest if you own a diode laser, any type of laser, and you're thinking about either getting started with one or going into business, you guys really need to check out Laser Masters Academy. And again, I'll put links in the description below. So if you guys are interested in purchasing one of the EM Smart One 20 Watt Fiber Lasers, head on over to 3 I'll place links in the description below. They're having their Black Friday sale. From now until the end of November, they are gonna knock $200 off the EM Smart One plus free shipping and that shipping uh, is crazy because I live here in the US and it took literally seven days from China to my door and I was shocked how quickly that shipped so that free shipping is a huge deal not only that they are going to include a foldable shield that goes around your laser to protect your customer client's eyes uh, while you're there at your trade show or your gun show or your Christmas show. Uh, and of course, now when you're using this, make sure you wear your glasses at all times, your protective glasses at all times when you're using this. But that foldable shield is awesome. You can fold it up, throw it in your car, take the bolts out of this, fold it down, throw it in your car, and bring your laptop and you are good to go. Once again, thanks for joining us here on 3D Print Farm. If you have any questions, please drop them in the comments below and I would be glad to answer them. If you guys would like any tutorials on how I created this business card or anything on this table on how to engrave a flask or a P-Mag, please drop them in the comments below. I would be glad to show you how to engrave those items on the EM Smart One and help you make a little extra cash. Once again, thanks for joining us here on 3D Print Farm, and we'll see you again next time on 3D Print Farm. Bye now.